Roger Federer defeated Fernando Verdasco in three sets thanks to his mental strength and power. The Swiss felt satisfied with his performance, and in the press conference, he was asked how he managed to continue putting intensity during the match and staying focused. I mean, look, I'm used to it. It's okay for me. I think that was particularly difficult when I was younger, especially a teenager. It's just hard to stay out there, like you said, sort of focus with a point-for-point -point mentality. It's very difficult. You have to start to do that in practice. You can't expect wonders if you're not practicing well or hard enough or long enough, that in the match it's going to click every single time at some point you're going to have a bit of a lull. A luck could mean two double faults in a row, could mean you blink at the wrong time for some reason. I don't know what happens. I think as a junior, I was actually really trying to concentrate on playing a lot of tennis during the day, 3, 4, 5 hours, just to be out there, just to cope with it. Nowadays it's very easy. I think it's just important, when I'm playing to sort of not play the percentages too much. As you get older, I don't want to say you play safe in any way, but you know so much what could happen, the outcomes. You predict a lot. Sometimes it's better to let it fly off the racket and go against logic. That's I think my biggest not struggle but my biggest sort of thing I have to come through mentally. Federer was also asked if he ever played a match with the new Hawkeye system Fox 10 that implemented 40 cameras on the court, I doubt it. Yeah, I don't even know about it. I don't know. You know the tournaments I've played. I guess there they haven't used it. Hasn't it been Hawkeye all the way? I'm not sure. I can tell you.